Well, um, uh, today I want to rant about um, what is happening with uh, Mr. Trump and the uh, uh, the heroes of the United States of America. No, the America. No, the heroes of uh, Europe. No, I want to know about the heroes of the United States of America. They say that President Trump say the bunch of suckers. The United States of America heroes and soldiers are a bunch of suckers. They say the media or the environment say the Mr. President Trump say the bunch of losers because they believe in the industrialist wars. They believe that they needed to go fight for the country and the reality is the industrialist sent them to fight. And because Mr. Trump allegedly said that these people are a bunch of losers and suckers for believing they fought for America, America. And they were completely conditioned to go into battle. And for that reason, they're a bunch of suckers and idiots. And their reflexes are completely conditioned to follow industrialists without thinking. That allegedly what Mr. Trump said. Mr. Trump also allegedly say, I wonder what was in it for them. <laughs> I wonder. I wonder how come they uh, a, a, a man a, a, they, you will think that he is a completely sane person, intelligent man, goes into battle <laughs> and die thinking that he's dying for his country. That is what allegedly he said. I don't think the man said that. And I do not like that man. I do not like Mr. Trump. But I do like Melania. <laughs> uh, I love Melania. And uh, also Ivanka. And uh, also the dad, the, uh, the mother of uh, the junior guys. You know, the girl from Germany or Russia or something. I love those European girls. But I don't think the man said that. I think what is showing us is that we do no longer have a country, a nation, or actually on the planet, a truly generalistic workforce. What we have is repeaters selling. They are sell reps. That is what we have. So when a guy like me come in and tell you, you are a thief, a thief of valor, a thief of symbols, a thief of identity. You are nothing but a, a zero trying to make a book without regard of humans on this planet. Sending them to war and then attacking them themselves where they bury in Arlington National Cemetery is so shameful that you are utilizing the greatest people that we have lost defending this country, or at least they were believing in the defense of their own nation, even if you just hijack them, if you just hack them, if you just brainwash them into going to battle. They die believing they were fighting for their country. They were not believing they were fighting for an industrialist like Donald Trump or fighting for a politician like Mr. Joe Biden. They die in battle believing they were defending me. Well, saludos and uh, please analyze what I'm saying. The television, the radio is no longer serving you. They are still serving 
someone that is paying them to condition you, to send you into battle, to call you colors, to divide us, to destroy us, to make us weak by dividing us. Don't let them.